Hey everybody, my name is Kat and welcome back for another video of Still Rising. Uh, we're gonna probably finish this uh, game in this video. I'm definitely doing a longer video for sure for this uh, vi uh, game, boys, because uh, as I'm talking, I'm recording games. Uh, I'm up to five games now with the new Call of Duty games that came out. I am gonna play this game for you guys. So I'm up to a lot of games. Five games at the same time to play. And I don't feel like doing two games per day at all, so I'm just doing basically longer videos. So uh, it's a lot of games right now I gotta deal with. So uh, I gotta finish this game off. I gotta really finish this like game off big time, boys. It's, otherwise, we're never gonna finish it. So it's important to finish this one off as soon as possible, boys. If we can finish him off uh, real quick. Uh, we are basically at the end, though. I feel like we're at the end. We are the uh, best side place. All we need to do is just literally defeat these uh, these enemies and stuff like that. So that all oh, that's literally all we gotta do. Let me just do that really quick. Get rid of the uh, thing. So that's literally all we gotta do is defeat these um, all these little bo uh, mini bosses and whatnot. Probably defeat a big boss in the end. And afterwards, we're gonna be fine. Yeah, we don't need to worry about any of this, boys. There's a lot of soldiers, a lot of uh, boss and stuff I gotta defeat. That's crazy, though. A lot of XP for me. That's gonna give me a lot of anima right here, boys. There we go. A lot of anima for me. That's what I'm talking about right here. We can just simply go right here, though. I don't need to uh, fight everybody, per se. I really don't need to. We're gonna rush through this because I really want to finish this game off as soon as possible. I enjoy playing this game a lot, boys. But I don't necessarily need to, you know, fight all these goons and stuff like that. That's just a waste of time. Where do I go with this? Interesting little place, boys. We can literally go around by the maze and stuff and not have to fight everybody. We really, literally can uh, can, uh, can prevent ourselves from having to fight everybody. There's a lot of people here. I'm just going to uh, defeat these enemies. Ooh, that's a lot of people. Okay. We got we to gotta chill. We're going to have to destroy these. Destroy these, uh, these dogs and stuff. We gotta be extra careful. Look at all of this, man. The amount of enemies there is. Okay, I'm gonna just throw a bunch of flame grenades. A bunch of flame grenades in here and here and there, boys. No improved frame, uh, frame, uh, flame grenades as well. Why not, boys? Let's go. Whoa, watch out now. Watch out now. I'm actually losing a lot of health quite quickly right here. Gotta be careful. That uh, flame grenade, though, is doing a lot of damage to them. Love to see that. There goes uh, one of them. Ooh, watch out, watch out. Nope. We cannot have that happen to us now. Uh, let me just heal myself far pretty quick. Oh, shit. We are doing a lot of damage, boys. I gotta be extra careful. There we go. That's some damage right here. Let me just defeat him. And he's done. All right. Just one more. One more right here. Oh, shit. There we go. Do not miss the, the attack right here. There we go. Just keep attacking him. And he's done. That was a lot of enemies, boys. Gotta keep healing myself right here. That was really a lot of enemies. That was crazy. Alright. Where do we go from there? Can we actually open the gate? Oh, we do. We did have the key to the chateau. Good. Alright. We're in. And this is a vestal right there as well, boys. It's going in right now. It's going in. Closing down this shit. Big time. Uh, we got a lot of XP from that, obviously. Feel like we're gonna get uh, the big time stuff happening right here. Let's get to the boot sick first. Sell a bunch of stuff that we don't necessarily need. Uh, we got the great tree stuff. I actually don't know if I have enough uh, uh, enough uh, of everything really. I, I I don't know if I have enough keys to upgrade. No, I don't have enough keys to upgrade this module. Well, it's whatever I guess, boys. Whatever. All of my stuff are basically upgraded to max, so all I can do really is upgrade those things right here. So, level 13 for this? I can't. Oh, I need at least 100. Damn, that's a lot. Alright, well, we're not upgrading ourselves, boys, I guess. Not in this video. No, no, not early on, that's for sure. Let's keep it going. There's uh, even more enemies we gotta fight. Uh, I am gonna fight these guys. No problem, boys. Gonna fight them. Kind of rusty a little bit with the mechanics of the combat. But because I've got really good weapons, I'm doing pretty good, boys. Let's go. Keep attacking him. He's going to be dead in a second. There he is. There he goes. 
I'm kind of rusty a little bit, but uh, should be good, boys. Should be good enough. Let me just take care of the dogs really quick. They actually managed to get a hit on me, which is not good, boys. Let's go. Get him, get him. Get him right there. There it is. It's a lot of stuff we got to do, boys. So I can't get past this gate. Uh, I got to go. Okay, I got to get through there. Got to get through there first. Let's see what we got, boys. I got a feeling uh, it's we're not done fighting people yet. It's just starting. We're only starting right now. Okay, here we go. Here we go, boys. Look at this disaster. This place is uh, a dead zone. Versailles, man. We need to find the key and kill this man already, boys. By the way, I do want to thank you guys for all the support that we're, you've been giving me uh, so far. It's really been uh, crazy. I really, um, really like you guys. Really support you. All right. Uh, I really appreciate you all guys for giving me this incredible support and stuff like that. It means a lot to me. Uh, yes, I know about the poll that I did do about uh, Super Seducer. That's going to have to wait for a while because I'm... I did create a poll asking if eventually I was going to play the game or not. Uh, you guys did for the most part ex uh, wanted me to play the game. So I might play, I may, not, or may or may not play. I'm going to consider it. I'll consider it for sure, but right now I've got so much stuff going on that I cannot play another game like I'm already at five games right now So yeah, way too many games going on boys. I'm in the middle of uh, Game season right here. So I, I, I can't be focusing on a game that's already came out a while ago, you know So uh, for now, we're just gonna focus on uh, what we got in front of us So where we do uh, where do we go from here? I gotta actually find the right area. I think this should be it right here. This should be the uh, direction I need to go at. Yeah, it seems like it, boys. It seems like I'm going the right way. Just defeat these uh, automats. There's one more down. Get a lot of XP. I'm already at 150, uh, 50k from that. Let's keep moving, boys. Let's keep moving. Here we are. The Orangerie. All right. Now what? Uh, uh, now what? I gotta go to the top. I don't need to fight all these. These are just bosses that I don't necessarily need to fight, uh, boys. So, yes, they're there. They're just there to get me, uh, I guess, some points, right? Some XP points. So, uh, those are really in my way. Like this guy, I'm gonna fight them. But uh, for the the other ones, I don't necessarily need to fight them. Okay, this guy swing, swing at me, big time. Watch out now. Get him. Get this man. There we go. Finally, he's out. Now, how do I get to there? I gotta get to there somehow. I don't think I can. Oh, I don't think. Oh, I know how to do. Oh, uh, yeah, there we go. Easy, boys. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. So you you jump uh, from rooftop to rooftop, I guess. So that's what they wanted you to do, I guess, in the first place. Now we go from this side right here, and we're gonna be able to uh, go from the other side. Can we open that gate for us? We sure can. That's, that path is uh, is unlocked now. Good. Let's keep it moving. We've got... Uh, we need to go to uh, over here. So let's keep it moving, boys. So many stuff going on. Replacement lever. Child is this way. Someone is expecting me. I can feel it. I must prepare for the worst. There's a ladder right here. About to be a cutscene, boys. Madame. The Estates General brandish the threat of rebellion. There is plotting afoot. They are stirring up the populace. Worse, they are making pacts. A number of representatives of the nobility and the clergy have taken up the cause of the Third Estate. As for my army, there is not a man among them I can trust. That is why I have made new arrangements for you. From now on, the Swiss Guard will no longer be protecting you. Then who will, my love? Take a look for yourself. Be assured you are in sturdier hands. Uh, what? Uh, whatever do you mean? Isn't that Lucia? Monsieur Vaucanson's dancing doll? Appearances can be deceiving, madame. The Count has made extraordinary improvements to this automat. Ages. 
This is Her Majesty the Queen. You are now to serve her. Make sure no harm comes to her and obey the orders she will give you. Madame, I am at your service. Patrulissa? He can speak. This makes no sense. This is sorcery. Make no mistake, madame. It is science, which we owe to the work of the Count. And which will soon be made known to the entire world. Intriguing. So that's how we met for the first time. Very intriguing. So we got the clockwork, uh, clockworker key, which means oh we uh, we actually have to uh, activate this. By the way, gotta get rid of that. So what would have happened if I actually did not uh, interacted with that cutscene or whatever? I'm guessing I would have needed to do that anyways. So. I guess uh, since I did it, I don't, I don't have to worry about it anymore, boys. It's not the king. It's the, it's like obviously the count that created, that did all of this uh, shit. But we need to take both of them out. The king and the count, boys. They are both equally dangerous right here. There's my carriage. Oh, by the way. I could go in there and try and uh, do my thing, boys. But I'm not going to do that. Not going to do that right now, boys. Already know. Let's kill these uh, guys real quick. These are difficult enemies right here that we're going to have to defeat as well. The ones with the shield are the most dangerous ones by far. Uh, because they can protect themselves. Obviously, they can counterattack. They do a lot of damage as well. But I managed to uh, deal with them. No problem. Get my health back, please. There we go. Now, we got to repair this. Repair the lever, boys. And now, we can actually activate it and pass the door. There it is. We're finally past, boys. This place is full of cannons, but they're not really using those cannons. Let's uh, jump up, boys. And there it is. Look who it is. The king himself and the count. About time that we finish them off, boys. Look at those moves, boy. It's holy. Shit's crazy, man. Crazy moves, boys. All right. Let's do the, uh, the uh, let's do our thing, boys. There we go. That's what I'm talking about right here. There we go. Oh, shit. Watch out now. There we go. Keep attacking her, and we've got the flame damage over time as well, which is great. Really doing a lot of, uh, lot of uh, damage to him, to the Iron Queen boys. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about right here. Man, this is crazy right here. Get the, get the grenades in here. There we go. Do as much damage as possible. That's what I'm talking about right here. I might as well equip uh, the other weapon as well, right? While we're at it. Oh, this is, does a lot of damage to me. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and heal myself up right away. Not gonna mess around with this. And I'm gonna just throw a bunch of flame uh, frost grenades as well. Like all the passive abilities right here. There we go. Oh shit. Watch out. Get her. Get her right here. There we go. That's what I'm talking about right here, boys. Get her, get her, get her. There we go. We got her. We got her. We got her for sure. We're gonna beat her, no problem, boys. She's not actually posing any threat to me at all any threat to me at all boys boom there we go just like that just like that boys okay. she kind of does a knee wee and stuff we gotta watch out and she's basically dead she's basically dead oh that's not good got her and we got her right here done and done boys what you thought she could beat me where are you going Running away? You ain't going nowhere. Oh, see how the Aegis turns against its master. Not 
My master tyrant! You never were! I am quite happy to concede this point, but what about the Count? Have you forgotten that he gave you life and whispered the order that animates you? Look how he runs, the coward! Do you understand what he has in mind? La pauvre enfant sleeping so sweetly, she won't be dreaming for long now! The fuck has he done? The fuck has he done to the child? This man is a fucking maniac, Don't man. Move. The time has come to set you free, Aegis. This whore soul has poisoned your cogs for too long. Adieu, sand puppet. I don't want to die. I stop running away, bitch. Atanias. The sun is rising. And you have slept for far too long. The beauty of this world longs for you. Just as you long for its light. For you are like the flowers that open in the morning. I know you, Mona. We loved each other. Vous en souviens-t-il? You gave me your heart. So please, let me give you mine today. Vive heureuse, Atenaeus. For it is happily that I leave this world. Monsieur, we have the king. It is now up to us to wield his scepter. In this trying time, crucial decisions must be made without delay. First and foremost, we must take back Paris. And how do we do that, mon dieu? There are automats everywhere, and they are constantly regenerated by their crimes. We have the king. Cagliostro has fled, but he is leaving a trail of blood. I doubt he will survive his injuries. As a result, the automats are left to their own devices, with no one to give them orders and no reinforcements. And since I'm sure the Parisians will no longer venture out into the streets, the machines will soon have no more souls to harvest. Sooner or later, they will no longer be able to move, and par la grâce de Dieu, will become inanimate objects again. It's a matter of days, weeks at most. Mais ensuite, once peace has been restored, what of the kingdom? This is indeed a crucial issue. Leaving the nation without a government would expose it to the greatest danger. Worse, it would condemn it to civil war. Eh bien, quoi, monsieur? Can you not govern together? Unfortunately, the disagreements that divide our assembly run far too deep. That which we can agree is that we have been given a chance to choose the person who shall succeed the tyrant. I believe I am the person who is best suited to exercise power. Of course, I will only hold office for as long as it takes to set up a new assembly and a government of the people. For the French will no longer tolerate a king. We can be sure of that. Are you joking? What have you done that would convince us to let you take down the monarchy? Answer, Monsieur de Robespierre. You have our full attention. Monsieur, I rest my case. Very well. We must now make our decision. I pray that each of us shall respect this decision and set aside our personal interests for the sake of peace and the common good. 
Who among you approves the appointment of Monsieur Maximilien de Robespierre? Why are they choosing Robespierre of all people, boys? The worst guy ever. Fucking crazy maniac, boys. And he ended up being not crazy enough for the populace as well. It ended up being executed eventually as well, so... Those Frenchmen, all just a bunch of crazy people in those times. Just killing each other for no particular reason. That's all they are. And I don't know, I really don't agree. That's one of those things uh, in life that, in history, that I agree the less with. Executing the king, worst thing that ever happened for France, boys. That was so stupid. They didn't even give him a chance in the trial or anything. They really, really were like the most revolutionary uh, type of people ever, man. That's a real revolution right there. A lot like the Russian one. They execute the king, the emperor. They don't give a fuck. They really don't. That's the worst way to go about it, too, though. Really, really. Like, uh, for me, revolution-wise, you should just, you know, do it the more silent way. Like, peaceful way. Resolute did the peaceful way. Don't just, like, literally kill everybody in their way. That's not the way to go about it, boys. Never worked. Did not... In the long term, it worked longer for the Russians, but uh, it did not long for the. It did not last long for the uh, for French. Ended up with another king eventually, boys. They only had kings, pretty much. By the most awful of men, I believe that the genius of machinery could overcome death itself. Alas, I have lost this fight, and I'm branded with a mark of murderer. Life, even more than the crown was heavy for me to bear. I have suffered too long under the thumb of nature, which I despised. As a child, I saw my older brother die. I lost my father in the prime of his life, and then my mother, who was even younger. My beloved daughter did not live a year. As for my son, the first of my heirs, I unknowingly gave him to drink from a poisoned cup. I mourn the death of these poor souls daily. My death will not unite us of this, I am so Yeah, it definitely won't. It's only gonna divide everybody. I've lost the support of my faith. So, executioner, lay me down on this board of a tube. I will sleep now. Sleep at last. And not to dream. Well, there it is. We did finish it, boys. That uh, was pretty good game overall. It's kind of a, an interesting way to go about the, re the revolution, I guess. It's not really a revolution. They kind of switched the history. They did their own history about it and stuff like that. Kind of a weird way. And like Marie Antoinette was like the good girl in this one for some reason, even though she was the worst by far, even like a lot worse than the king himself. Marie Antoinette is one of the main parts as to why the revolution happened in the first place. Uh, so I don't know, boys. It, it kind of felt weird that she was like a benevolent queen and stuff. And the king was like in the wrong here. When she was clearly the one that was the main problem of the whole situation. But, you know, everybody's at fault. Everybody that you saw in this game, all these so-called... Um, historic characters there were all kind of bad people they're really all kind of kind of crazy in the head and that's why they the french for many years ended up all over the place so um i'm gonna just leave it here i guess pretty good game i got nothing really to say about it uh 
happy I finally ended. Even though I really enjoyed playing the game, I have so many other stuff, other projects to play for you guys. So uh, we're just basically starting anew. We're gonna have a COD coming up soon. And along with all the other ones like NHL, Franchise Mode, we've got still Metal Ages that we're playing currently, and of course Gotham Knights. So remember to leave a like and subscribe to the interview. I'll see you guys for the next one. Keep it easy.